once up to speed, though, the extra mid-range response is most welcome, the Velo chain equally satisfying whether you leave the 8-speed auto to its own devices or take control via the aluminium pedals. Optional on lesser Julius they're standard on the Velo chain and much more exotic than the flimsy plastic pedals seen on rivals such as the Audi A4. Alfa Romeo has done an excellent calibration job with the gearbox and you never really crave a manual, the ability to flick up and down the box to tap into the engine's sweet spot making twisty mountain roads an enjoyably interactive experience. Although we drove the Q4 version its torque bias gives a good sense of how the rear-driven UK car will handle. Like all Julius the steering is light, direct and responsive, and in combination with well-judged spring, damper rates it has a great sense of flow. To the extent that the sharper damper setting, dialed in by switching to dynamic on the three-way DNA switch, really isn't necessary. Thankfully you can override it and keep the dampers in their softer setting while enjoying the crisper throttle response and gear shifts. Or just not bother with the 1950 pounds performance package they're bundled in with. Should I buy one? A satisfying steer on an enjoyable A-road, the Jewy of Aloche is also comfortable and refined on the motorway. This is a sporting saloon in the classic mold, with an expertly judged balance between refinement and excitement. Everything you'd hope for in an Alfa Romeo, in other words, with few of the excuses required in the past. It's up against some very, very accomplished products though. And detail weaknesses, not least in the infotainment system and perceived quality of some touch points, are not to be dismissed. The Germans do both better. And if we're nitpicking the engine's extra power is welcome but it's not quite the charismatic heart and soul of the car you might have hoped for. But as an overall package the Julia is more than good enough to satisfy both heart and head. More so thanks to a bit more power and some extra choice in the rain. Alfa Romeo's resurgence continues apace, 